flowers and vines. So the way that this works is you start out by drawing a wavy wobbly spiral. And in my mind, these look a little bit like roses. So day one, draw some squiggles. Something that if you've been to art school, you would know, I've not really been to art school, but I've taken a few art classes, is that um, whenever we're drawing objects, they tend to look better in odd numbered groups than even numbered groups. So here I've got four, now I've got five of these spirals, and you notice that the five look better. That's day one. Day two of this practice, you're gonna go back and you're gonna add vines. So connect these flowers with vines that go between them. And if you want to, you can play with what it looks like to make these three-dimensional. You notice that there's some crisscrossing of the vines themselves. When I do this, I'll sometimes, sometimes I'll let my flowers all be on the same vine. Sometimes they're coming off of different vines. After you add vines, you can go ahead and go in and add some leaves if you like. Again, that number, the odd number of items might be fun here to think about. So right now I have four leaves. I'll give myself a fifth. And then the last part of this practice is to go in and add some flair. So of course you'll be adding some color and some shadows if you want to. You can also go in and add some insects. And lately I've really been enjoying drawing little tiny like bees or flies that kind of have these zoom lines behind them. So you'll see me drawing a lot of those these days. And again, odd numbers tend to look great for these um, things that we're adding in. So while it's absolutely not about the art, every now and then I'll give you some tips about composition to help you lay out the page. So I look forward to seeing your flowers and vines and flair. Um, draw any kind of flowers that you want. Feel free to go in and add flowers back to this, whatever suits you. But post on the community page if you're a member of Doodle and Flow. And if not, please post on Instagram or Facebook and, and tag. Tag Doodle and Flow Challenge, Doodle and Flow. I look forward to seeing your work. <laughs>